Welcome back to Breakfast Central. Now let's share with you what Nigerians are saying as we head into the streets of social media. Our first story today, what can 200,000 Naira do for you? Well, the CEO of Epis, Alan Onyema, in an interview did say that 200,000 Naira, those earning 200,000 Naira in Nigeria are living a much better life or you know, have a better quality of life or a better chance than those who are earning 2,000 pounds in the UK. Let that sink in. Now let's see what Nigerians are saying about that. A lot of Nigerians have gone to social media to share their reactions. This is from General Oblak. He says, minimum wage in UK is 11.4 pounds. Now, 11.4 times 9 hours is equal to 102.6 pounds. 102.6 times 30 monthly, that's assuming that they're working up to 30 days, is 3,078 pounds. He then says, okay, let's go to conversion. And you'll see that someone in the UK, after the attacks, will comfortably give you 200k in Nigeria every month if he's not a reckless spender there. Moving away from General O Black, we have Nigerians are highly unpatriotic. This is from Hamless. Okay, okay, this is, this is in reference to our dollar tweet. We'll take this one much later. Let's go to the next tweet. Um, this one says, the question is, who's even earning 200K in Nigeria? The money that can't sustain a whole family for two weeks, the fact is that 100K can't buy family monthly feeds. Not below, my family as a case study. So he's using his family as a case study. Now, our next tweet is from, uh, this is from The Great Kenny. Let's move on quickly to the next tweet. Eric Okafor says, rich people glorifying mediocrity is a wild. $2,000 monthly salary is quite low in the US. I want to believe, okay, yeah, it is in the US, but not as unfortunate as 200,000 naira in Nigeria. But this is, of course, in comparison to 2,000 pounds in the UK and 200,000 naira in Nigeria. So I'm bringing that choice before you. Two thousand pounds in the United Kingdom, two hundred thousand naira here in Nigeria every month. Even though I know you, you know you are not really like the two hundred thousand naira gang. What What are your thoughts as quickly as possible? Well, I will say that uh, personally, I went to the market. No, not market, supermarket. Okay, so we do monthly shopping every time. And um, by the time we go to the supermarket, we normally would spend a hundred thousand naira at the supermarket. Yeah, but only recently we spent. 185,000 naira, and these are basic things that we actually need. These are not luxuries. So you can imagine what 200,000 naira is like, personally to me, or what the average person out there is actually using 200, or, or who's getting 200,000 naira. Question is, who exactly is getting 200,000 naira in Nigeria? If you're yes. getting 200,000 naira, trust me, it's, um, it, it's, it's quite a big deal. Um, What's the minimum wage now? Would you remind me what the minimum wage is now? What people are getting as My, minimum I'm not even quite sure at this point because yeah. it's meant to be like 30,000 naira. Exactly. And then there's people talking about, that's why Nelson is pushing for mobile. We're not yet there. Well, to be honest, I, I think I can totally understand those sentiments. Um, I, I, I don't know how to react to it. But yes, in case you're just tuning in, this tweet by Wisdom Ekong sort of briefly explains. It says, FPCO said, anyone earning 2,000 pounds in London is a pauper. And if you're earning 200,000 in Nigeria, you're better off because you can hire a maid, a driver. And I agree with him completely. Mm. I don't agree with him, though, in this particular one. London, only monthly house rent is 2,000 to 5,000 pounds. 2,000 pounds may not be enough for house rent, not to talk of other bills. In Nigeria, if you're single or married with few children, 200,000 naira is a big money. I don't agree with the driver and maid. Have you no. seen how much drivers are charging now? No. Drivers are charging within, say, 80,000 to 200,000. So mm -hmm. if you're paying driver 80,000 to 200,000, you're paying your maid. How much do you have left? How much do you have to feed? But I would think that these numbers can only make sense. When is it? Anyway, I, sh I shouldn't say that. There are some people who this is their reality. But let us know what your thoughts are on Twitter. At New Central TV, do you think that 200,000 naira is enough to be able to power you? and your family. If you're a single person or a married person, let us know what your thoughts are on social media.